Yo, I'm back and we have a lot of videos to catch up. This one is gonna be good. I know Beat Pella House, Rob Roy and always when Beat Pella uploads, you can expect highest level of production. So yeah, I'm really excited. Let's get into this Beat Pella House, Rob Roy. Is that a cover or original? Let's see. See? Already. Crazy. Ah! Wing! Huckles rapping? Can can do anything if I can make you mind. Lost in a haze, mind in a days, can't in a maze, memories fade. I'm gonna chase you down. Surely I can make you wear the crown. Play this, play this in the radio, play this in the radio. I don't see any difference from the audio quality from the songs playing on the radio. And this has such an interesting flair to it because it's beatboxing. You can still hear the beatbox, of course, like pretty clear, but the production value is just so high that there's no difference in quality to songs playing on the radio. Man, I have a feeling that it doesn't take too long for beatbox to hit the radio, to be honest. I could also see Tara Stanian videos, uh, audios, songs being played on the radio. But with his videos, I feel like it would take a little longer because it's just one guy beatboxing and it doesn't sound like a produced song like this Beat Pella House, Rob Roy, for example, all the other stuff. I just have a feeling because there's no difference for me in sound quality, but beatbox is just so interesting and so new and so young still. So I think there's a lot of room for beatbox to hit the mainstream. Let's enjoy it one more time. Try to analyze what is going on. And yeah, I was really pleasantly surprised to hear Huckle rapping. I think everyone of this crew is just improving so much and I'm so happy to see it. This is so simple, but it grooves so much. Oh my god, just adding some shakers in. Oh. Woo! 
Hi-Hat, Snare, Voice. I love Yela's voice, by the way, and I think she's the perfect addition to the group. I say that because this group has now existed for a long time, but Huckle and his was a tag team before, Jackpot, Hellcat and the Wing, and then they get Yela. I don't know where they get her from. Very good choice. <laughs> really just reminds me that you can achieve a lot with a lot less than you think because this is clearly not the most complicated and technical routine and it shouldn't be because it's super musical super easy to follow along and especially for the mainstream but it just sounds really really good and sometimes less is more and here it applies you have just simple throat bass drum sounds hi-hats shaker and a kick drum and a snare and just voice and some trumpets in the background. So it's not too complicated actually, but just the sound choices, of course the production, and they are top tier beatboxes, of course. This is just pleasing to the ears. This is music, man. Beatbox reached such a high level, man. Crazy, crazy. Beat, beat Pella House, Rob Roy. What a tune, man. What a track. I still don't know if this was a cover or original. Let's see. Maybe they... No, it's Beat Pella House, Rob Roy. It's their own. Okay, see. Composed by Wing, His, Hayan, Yella, E. Lyrics by... Wing Yella Huckle, arranged by Hiss and Wing, Mix Mastered, Sinjo Hiss. Yeah, that's crazy, man. That's a really strong crew. They're doing everything on their own, and it's crazy. It's inspiring to see, man. Really inspiring to see. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you, Beat for this crazy good tune. And see you for the next video. <laughs>